In this video, I'm going to show you how to enable additional attributes in Exclaimer Cloud. Here's what I mean. In Exclaimer Cloud, you make an email signature template. You decide what the layout will be, what images should go in there, but we can fill in the contact details for you. In this case, I've got display name, job title, and for Karen, they become Karen Green and graphic designer. But maybe I want more than job title. Maybe next to this, we have another thing we use, uh, it's job description. And in here I can see things like company name, city, email. But wait a minute, how do I get to job description? I know that's in my local Active Directory. But why can't Exclaimer see it? Well, we can, we just need to change a simple setting. So I'll close out of here. And there's really one quick change I need to make. Over here, under settings, and then under data synchronization, we have this additional Azure AD attributes. Some of you watching might already have custom attributes enabled. This lets us see everything in your Azure AD and anything extra synced up from your local AD that isn't in the Azure Active Directory typically. So let's click edit. And I want this top option, sync all Azure AD attributes, includes everything synced from local AD. I'll click next. And then it will show me a little uh, progress symbol as it allows Exclaimer Cloud to see those additional Azure AD attributes. All right, perfect. So in here, I'll click close. And then we will close out of here. And when I go back into that same signature design I was using, if you remember earlier, I wanted to put something next to job title. Now, when I look at those list of attributes, I can see the 15 custom attributes from Office 365. And I can see some extra ones that were specifically from my own local Active Directory. Perfect. Thanks for watching.